There is frustration and concern in Attleboro tonight after the parents of a student who tested positive for COVID-19 sent him to class on Monday. Now, more than two dozen students have been forced to quarantine. WBZ's Beth Germano is live in Attleboro tonight with the very latest on this story. Beth? Well, in this case, the mayor of Attleboro says no one is to blame but the parents for putting other students and staff at risk. School officials say they worried about COVID exposure during the school year, but never thought it would happen so quickly on day one. She's upset and scared. Kim Evers' daughter, a sophomore at Attleboro High School, is now one of 30 students home in quarantine until the end of the month, all because she came in contact with a classmate who has tested positive for COVID-19. And city officials say he knowingly came to school on Monday. Parents knew they shouldn't have done that. The student knew he shouldn't have done that. I mean, we we're six months into the pandemic, and that shouldn't have happened. But it did, the mayor says, because of timing. The district receiving notice of the student Sunday and unable to spread the news quickly enough before he was at their doorstep. Principal Bill Rooney says if there's a silver lining, contact tracing happened quickly. The fact that we were able to get the seating charts from the classrooms within minutes, get the seating charts uh, from the cafeteria immediately, um, and, you know, and within an hour get the seating chart from the bus, we were able to very quickly put that list together and then um, our nursing team went right to work to contact. But Kim Evers can't return to work until she gets a negative test result. And like many parents, is frustrated and anxious. First, the safety for her because I don't want her to get sick because um, she goes down pretty hard when she gets sick. Uh, but I tried to calm her down more than anything because she was worried herself. And other students worried as well. I think that's very frightening because you put everybody's health in danger and put everybody at risk. The school system believes it has strong protocols in place to monitor students' health and safety. Still, the mayor worries the situation could happen again. I want to be realistic and honest with people. There is very likely that we have kids who are there, COVID positive right now, who are asymptomatic and don't even know it. Now, the principal says five other students have also tested positive, but they did stay home. It's unclear if there will be any disciplinary action in this case. Reporting live from Attleboro, I'm Beth Germano, WBZ News. A number